The Psychology of Happiness 10 Steps to a Better Life Happiness is a state of mind that is responsible for us feeling good about ourselves, irrespective of any external situation or circumstance. Mahatma Gandhi, an Indian lawyer, anti-colonial nationalist said, Happiness is when what you think, what you say, and what you do are in harmony. Sometimes we mistake happiness for the things that we have, when in the real sense, happiness lies in how we think and how we choose to view things. It's like this. You can be in a situation that's unpleasant and still feel calm about it because of how you've chosen to think about it. Dale Carnegie, an American writer, once said, It isn't what you have, or who you are, or where you are, or what you are doing that makes you happy or unhappy. It is what you think about. We all desire to be happy and stay happy forever. However, to achieve that, we have to be intentional about it. You can get something because you merely wish for it, like achieving your career goal. Happiness is a goal that you have to be strategic about and work towards achieving. The Dalai Lama said, Happiness is not something ready-made. It comes from your own actions. So, in this video, I'll share with you the psychology of happiness. 10 Steps to a Better Life If you're new here, consider subscribing so you won't miss other interesting videos like this. Number 1. Make the present moment your focus Have you ever heard these words before? Happiness is the art of never holding in your mind the memory of an unpleasant thing that has passed. You have to be willing to let go of unpleasant memories from your past and also let go of your worries for the future. Focus on the present moment and make every one of it count. According to Marcel Pangnol, a French novelist and filmmaker, the reason people find it so hard to be happy is that they always see the past better than it was, the present worse than it is, and the future less resolved than it will be. Make every single day the most important day of your life, and you'll be glad you've chosen to live your life making every moment count. Number 2. Don't compare yourself to others It doesn't matter what other people are doing or how they are living their lives. Your priority and focus should be you. The truth is that comparing yourself to others financially, physically and socially is a trap because you'll always have friends who have more money than you or friends who are more fit than you. So how long will you go on doing that? Focus on you. Number 3. Decide to love and accept yourself Marcus Aurelius Antoninus said, very little is needed to make a happy life. It is all within yourself, in your way of thinking. How do you think of yourself? How do you treat yourself? If you don't love and accept yourself the way you are, you might never be happy with yourself no matter what you acquire. Love every condition that you have. It's as simple as that. Number 4. Set a goal for yourself and pursue them According to Arthur Schopenhauer, the two enemies of human happiness are pain and boredom. When you live life with no aim, no goal, no vision and dreams, you'll wake up every day to whatever life throws at you, instead of doing the things that you want to do. The end product of that is that you soon become bored and tired. This can lead to feelings of sadness, which might, in turn, lead to depression, if not curtailed. So. Set goals for yourself and ensure that you pursue each goal until you achieve them. When you do, it'll make you feel incredibly happy with yourself, knowing that you have the ability to achieve something that you set your mind to. Number 5. Keep learning Never stop learning. You see, when you stop learning, you stop growing and become stagnant. You'll begin to lose confidence in yourself. Learning helps you stay informed and also exposes you to new ideas that can help you stay curious and engaged. Number 6. Take care of your body Our body and mind are connected, so when we are active, 
it can boost our mood, lift us out of depression and make us happy. Taking care of your body means eating right and exercising regularly so that your body is energized and nourished with the right kind of nutrient to keep it healthy. Number 7. Try something new Whenever you choose to go to a new place, try out a new hobby, learn a new skill or try out a new meal, as long as you're doing something different from your usual routine, you'll feel good, pleased with yourself and your ability to learn or adapt quickly, depending on the situation. Number 8. Commit to connecting with your mind every day. Spend time with yourself daily. Your soul is your guide to your passions and purpose in life and guides your decisions on major issues in life. So, consider building a better connection with yourself by taking time out to meditate, even if it's just for a short time. The aim is to be mindful and help you live in the present moment. Number 9. Help Others Eleanor Roosevelt, an American political figure, said, Since you get more joy out of giving joy to others, you should put a good deal of thought into the happiness that you are able to give. Studies have shown over and over again that one of the best ways to live a happy life is altruism. You probably just asked, what is altruism? It is the principle and moral practice of concern for the happiness of other human beings and or animals, resulting in a quality of life both material and spiritual. When you make other people happy, you'll equally be happy. So find little ways to make the happy for people around you. Number 10. Be grateful. While it might look like you don't have the things that you so much desire in your life, it doesn't mean that you don't have some of the things you need. So, instead of focusing so much on what you don't have, be grateful for the things that you have. You'd be surprised how much joy this will bring to you. Besides, when you take time to be grateful more for the things that you have than those that you don't, you are less likely to take them for granted and less likely to become jealous of others. Thank you very much for watching our videos. If you like this video, watch more videos on our channel and subscribe. We love you.